All right, I wish we had more time, darn it. Okay, go ahead, Mark Romero. Well, you know, and I took flack for this, and I'm going to take it again right now, when I said that the problem that is systemic cannot be blamed 100% on one side of the equation, or that right. just leads to frustration and lack of solution. Look, I think what Farrell was trying to say, and what he didn't say maybe as artfully as we would have wanted, was we have to look at the whole picture. Mm -hmm. We do know, and even though he has passed now, we do know that there were some actions that Mike Brown took that probably exacerbated the situation. Doesn't lead that doesn't allow him to get killed, doesn't require him to get killed, but we have to realize that this is a solution that's got to cross all of the boundaries. It's got to be on both sides or else it's not going to be a solution. It's just going to be continued frustration. Mm -hmm. And I think that's what Pharrell was trying to say. That's what I said a couple of weeks ago in an op-ed I took flack for. But we can't just say it's the cops and it's always the cops, it's always the system. Because we can say that, but we don't go anywhere. And I think that's really tough. That's really harsh to say that, that he's responsible for his own death. I don't think, listen, I don't want to speak for Pharrell. I don't think that is what Pharrell is saying. And, and I think to do that, to put that so burden on him is to be disingenuous. I think Marco Mara has a very good point. Why can't the two coexist? Why can't you talk about both of them well, in the same vein? Why well, can't it be, be simultaneous? I'm not saying that Pharrell is saying... Well, just to be clear, I'm not saying Pharrell is saying that. I'm saying the consequence of what Pharrell is saying is that, it, is, that, is that that becomes the ultimate interpretation. If we talk about somebody who is unjustly killed and we talk about their behavior, that becomes the problem. It's just like if someone is raped and we say, well, yeah, but what was Mark. she wearing? The problem is even that conversation allows for that to happen. I yeah, think there is a systemic problem with police with police. And that's what we need to analyze here. Does that mean okay, people can't make good choices? Does that mean people can't make healthy choices? Sure. Of course they can. Mark, Mark one final thought because my producer is saying we have thought. to go. Mark, go Mark if, we ha if we looked at this completely dispassionately, how much of the responsibility for the outcome would you put on Mike Brown's shoulders? Any at all? Uh, which part? Uh, for, for being killed? If it, it depends well, on what we think for, about the evidence. For, if, if, for, for the, uh, any of it. For the situation as you know it, with the nuances, with the concerns, with the frustrations, with, with the disagreements you have with the evidence, would you put any of the responsibility on Mike Brown's shoulders, or is it all just Darren Brown, not for Darren being Wilson, because he was a cop? No, for the event that led to his death. No, not you know because he's a cop. About. No, 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 no. Yeah, but, but that's not a fair question. What I'm saying is he, he's the one with the gun. He's the one who killed. So, yes, it, irrespective of what, Brown, of what Mike Brown how did. How is that an unfair question? Because, because he's, 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 we, we, don't, we don't agree on what the facts are, and we don't agree on what the circumstances are. So he's, he's asserting a hypothetical that it... No, no, no. Mark, no, it's regardless not, saying, of the... Dis the part, go ahead. What I'm saying is that it, we can't say regardless of what happened because what, then what happens is you're asserting a hypothetical that is also counterfactual. I don't know what happened any more than you do with certainty. But based on my understanding of the facts, I say that Darren Wilson used excessive force. That means that even if Mike Brown was jumping up and down, butt naked in the street, c cursing out the officer, he still doesn't deserve to die. So to that extent, it is not Mike Brown's fault at all. That doesn't mean that Mike okay. Brown couldn't make different decisions. Okay. It right. doesn't mean that Mike Brown couldn't make better yeah. choices, uh, but he still didn't deserve not, to die. His death is exclusively Darren Wilson. And Mark, I hear you. It's really not a 30-second answer. It's not fair. I'd love for the three of us to do right. this with a half hour. Yeah.